You see, it is when you are weak, it is when you have tried your best and things are not working out for you, that is when people can see that it's only God that brings you out. Because when you are still strong, everything is going right for you, you may end up taking the glory. People may end up giving you, oh, that man is a strong man, is a, is a well-educated man, is a well-connected man. But when all of that fails, that is when they will know that ah, this can only be God. I pray for somebody here today. Whatever it is in your life that is not allowing the glory of God to be manifest, may that thing be subdued today in the mighty name of Jesus. And the strength of God that is made manifest in your weakness. Even as you are weak or you are going through some tough moment right now, may the strength of God be abundant upon your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's look at verse 10 of that passage again. It, it will encourage you. When Apostle Paul suddenly heard the voice of God saying, Calm down, my son. My grace is mighty upon your life. He said, Therefore, I will take pleasure in infirmities, in reproaches, in necessities, in persecution, in distresses, for Christ's sake. For when I am weak, then I am. In other words, he said, Now I realize that I'm a blessed person. That whenever I have challenges in my life, that is when I become a candidate for divine intervention. Look beyond yourself. That's why it says, blessed are they that mourn. Look beyond yourself. Look to the power of God. Philippians chapter 4 verse 13. Philippians 4 13 says, I can do all things through Christ that... How many of you believe that? that if, if Christ is on your side, you can do all things. God will help you. You will overcome. In Jesus' mighty name.